Hey guys, the objectives for this video are to derive an equation to relate curvature with deflection and to discuss boundary conditions. So if, if we have a look at a quick conceptual example here, um, we've got a portion of our beam that's in bending and it's got some deflection V and that's related to our Z axis here. So what we're looking for is to come up with an equation VZ. So our deflection in terms of the distance along our beam Z. So if we look at our beam here, it's going to have a slope of dv dz. It's also going to have a distance r from what's called the center of curvature. And then the rate of change of its slope, dv dz, is going to be um, its curvature, which we learnt was kappa in the bending topic. So from the bending topic, you should remember that kappa is equal to 1 over r, which is equal to m over ei. So we can use this to come up with an equation for our deflection. So using a bit of calculus and geometry, which is a little bit outside the scope of this course, 1 over r is equal to negative d squared v dz squared divided by 1 plus dv dz squared all to the power of 3 over 2. So what we know is that we're assuming that our deflections are quite small. So that, that's one of the assumptions that we make in this topic for deflections, that we're only considering uh, small deflections in our beam. So dv dz is small. So what that means then is that 